Hi, this is Andy Armacost, president of the University of North Dakota. The image behind me is of Memorial Stadium here on our campus in Grand Forks. And this stadium serves in the memory of all those who served in World War I and their dedication and their contributions and sacrifice to our nation meant so much. And if you think about today, Veterans Day, November 11th, it traces back to the armistice that would end the war to end all wars, World War I. And November 11th, 1918, the 11th hour of the 11th day of the 11th month served as our armistice. And in November of 1919, President Wilson proclaimed November 11th as the commemoration of Armistice Day. And he said, to us in America, the reflections of Armistice Day will be filled with solemn pride in the heroism of those who died in the country's service and with gratitude for the victory, both because of the thing from which it had freed us and because of the opportunity it has given America to show her sympathy with peace and justice in the councils of the nations. And later in 1938, Armistice Day would become a legal holiday and changed to Veterans Day. And in 1954, it was broadened to recognize the service of all American veterans across all wars. And I personally have had the chance to serve in uniform as a member of the active duty Air Force for 30 years. And so Veterans Day personally means so much to me. And it's my honor and privilege to lead now an institution, the University of North Dakota, that has for decades served our veterans and their families so perfectly and so diligently. And so today we remember the contribution of the service of all of our veterans and what they've meant to our nation. So please take a moment today to recall their service and to honor them. Thank you.